you get Later on Cause I Today I'm finally getting around to doing my room tour. This video has been requested by so many of you since I redecorated my room and I've just been holding it off for a little while because I've been really busy and I wasn't 100% happy with how my room was. I still had a few bits to sort out. At the moment my room is looking pretty good. There's still a few more things that I need to do. I would do this video vlog style. I hope you guys don't mind. So this is what it looks like when you actually walk into my bedroom so i'm gonna start off with the door so let me just shut that so on my door i just have my towel this towel is from Danal. i think it was like 20 pounds or something and it's a really good quality towel so over here i just have this um mirror there's actually i think four or five different mirrors and they've just been stuck together on the wall and they are from ikea i've had this on my wall for like a good couple of years now my mum stuck them up and i kind of hate having them here because i can't even see like my full body when i look in the mirror and they're literally stuck onto the wall with glue so I can't take them off and then above the mirror I just have this gorgeous heart decor piece which is from Primark so on this wall I just have my features so this is the only wall with wallpaper on it and um, if you saw my previous room tour or if you remember what my old room looked like I had very bold wallpaper before it's like a hot pink this is a lot more calm and subtle and I love it because it's got a slight like shimmer to it it's super pretty it's showing up darker on camera than what it really is but down here i just have my desk which is from ikea it is the mickey desk and inside i just store all of my makeup so if you guys would like to see a updated makeup collection then just let me know in the comments i keep one of my pandora bags on my desk i just have like the box inside and i have a little candle and then i just have this langley home candle in the scent sweet pea i hate the scent of it but the candle was super pretty i just have my laundry basket which i also use as a chair and then i just had this cushion that i made um i think i made it out of like an old bed sheet or something like that so moving on over here i just have my hamster cage or one of my hamster cages so i have a russian dwarf hamster her name is Kashmir, and she's gray and this is the living world eco habitat cage um i get a lot of questions about it you can find it on um zoo plus or amazon i've got the medium size and it's normally 140 something pounds but i got it on sale for like 120 or something like that so on the cage i have these fairy lights they are super pretty they're actually from the pound shop um i don't like the lights when they're on because they're actually cool lights so the switch is just here they're battery operated and they're like blue um they're like cool instead of warm tone so that was kind of annoying even though the packets said they were warm tone so i just like like them for decoration anyway i have two of the oh, i forgot what they're called i think they're the mom dresses so i just have two of them together they are the four drawer and i love these dresses so much i've actually wanted these drawers for ages because my sister had them and my mum had them um and yeah in this drawer i just have like all my night clothes and underwear and stuff um in this one i just have like cardigans and if you have a bits and bobs like tights and whatever so um i have clothes in this one but these are not like my everyday clothes um and then on this side i store all of my well not all of my pet stuff but all of my um business supplies because i run a business selling monthly subscription boxes um it's a little empty at the moment because i'm currently restocking so over here i have the ikea detail which is actually a display cabinet but i use it as a hamster cage and in here is my second russian dwarf hamster named cupcake she's like a golden yellow color i'm not too sure where she is right now um but yeah cashmere and cupcake are sisters if you didn't know that so over here i just have my window ignore my blinds um <laughs> i still need to get some new blinds and i also still need to get some new curtains i haven't gotten around to doing that just yet because i'm just so lazy um on my window ledge i have um three cactuses which are from ikea and these are like the fast plants i've ever had and i love them <laughs> i haven't managed to kill them just yet i almost did because i wasn't like watering them properly um but yeah my cactuses are doing really really well i just have my bedside table and if you guys didn't know i actually filmed um 
vlogs when I was redecorating my room. I think I did about three. And I think it was either on one of the vlogs or the video I'd done just after my vlogs. There was a girl that commented something like, Oh my gosh, why don't you put your bedside table next to your bed? Or something like that. And well, the reason why my bedside table isn't right next to my bed is because I have plug sockets there, which is the only plug sockets I can actually reach. I have another one or two, but it's behind... Um, these drawers and actually have a extension lead that plugs into it because I've got some lights um, which are here if I switch them on yeah I got some lights that turn on behind the cage and those lights are also from Ikea but um yeah this is where my plug socket is so I can't put my bedside table next to my bed or else I won't be able to reach it so at the moment I just have my iPad charger which I love because it's such a gorgeous pink and when you turn it on it actually changes color which is so cool this is from wilco if any of you guys were wondering so on top of my bedside table i have this um fake grass plant which is from ikea and so is the pot it's just this plain white one i've got my mug of lemon tea which i obviously didn't drink i made that this morning this um mug is from morrison's the coaster is from Ikea. I've got this little bird dish, which is actually to put tea bags on. That's from the Nelm, and I just have an EOS lip balm. I normally keep my two Pandora rings on here as well. I'm currently wearing them on my fingers, so yeah. So this is my bedside table, and I love it. This is like my favorite piece of furniture, or well, one of my favorite pieces of furniture in my bedroom it is so gorgeous i got this from amazon i think it was like 28 pounds or something like that and i changed the handle on it. it was just a plain silver one and i bought this crystal knob for a couple of pounds of amazon um and yeah and my bedside table is kind of messy but yeah that's just what it looks like so under my bed i just have like a load of stuff it's kind of messy under there but yeah um in these baskets are all my hamster stuff and it pretty much goes all the way to the back um over here i just have some makeup and stuff and then i have my travel bag so before i forget i have a rug on my floor from ikea i think this was like 10 pounds it was really cheap so the window cleaner is here so i'm just gonna wait until he's finished cleaning my window so above my bed i just have this dream sign which I did have in my old bedroom so over here let me just step back a little um over here is my bed which is like one of my other pieces of furniture which I love it's a white metal framed day bed and I've always 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 wanted a day bed I have a lot of people ask me where this bed is from it is from the range it was 119 pounds which was super cheap for a bed like I wasn't expecting the bed to be that cheap but it's just gorgeous it's got these um like crystals on top there's four of them so there's one on each end and the thing that is so weird is that the crystals are exactly the same to the one on my bedside table and i didn't even realize until like the first morning I woke up and I was just admiring my bedroom and then I was like oh my god they're the same so I have some fairy lights um at the top and the bottom end of my bed so I've just turned my fairy lights on but you can't really see them because it's daytime um but they're just these really nice white wooden stars and they are from the pound shop so my bed sheets are looking kind of creased right now but I don't really care so everything on my bed is from Primark. So on this end of my bed I just have my second Pandora bag which was the first bag I ever got and I don't know why but it's got like these yellow lines on it which is kind of sad um but yeah I'm going to be keeping this forever because it's it's just memory. I thought I would show you guys what's in the corner. I've just got my ring light which is gathering dust like I couldn't tell you the last time I actually used my ring light. I've just got a folder and I got my two tripods which you can't really see i've got this one and then that's my new one over here i have my alex nine drawers and my alex nine drawers are not filled with makeup like everyone else's so in this one i just have some notebook and in this one i just have some more like college bits i have like folders and stuff um and then down here i just have my laptop and my adorable pink mouse and yeah i'm not gonna go through all the drawers but if you guys want to see a alex Stein draw tour then let me know in the comments so on top of my 
Alex 9. I have, this is not supposed to be in here, but I just have um, some makeup bits. So I have some cotton buds in this acrylic container, which is from Tiger. I have two of the um, Ikea plant pots. Well, I think this one is actually for candles. And then at the back there, I just have my makeup mirror. So moving on to this part of my room, which I think is the last bit I have to show you guys. Um, on top of my wardrobe, I just have a few bits, but you know, just ignore that. And as you can see, it's got mirrored doors. This is like my favorite piece of furniture and it was also my most expensive piece of furniture so my wardrobe is from ikea it's a um custom made wardrobe so i basically designed it myself and i just love the fact that it has these glass doors i think they are just so gorgeous and it allows me to see my whole outfit and the fact that the doors are mirrored makes my room feel so much bigger so if we open it up i have to open it up with my foot because it comes with handles i didn't really want the handles because they would just be like right here and it just wouldn't look nice so this is what it looks like inside my wardrobe at the moment at the top i just have my handbags and they are sitting on this glass shelf so you can get just plain like wooden shelves so i decided to go for the glass one because then it makes the wardrobe feel a bit like bigger and open so yeah below that i have all of my jumpers and coats so as you can see i've got them all color coordinated so if you guys would like to see a wardrobe tour like in detail then just let me know in the comments um my wardrobe's kind of messy at the moment so ignore that i've got another glass shelf here and i just have like some more bags and stuff um over here i just have this pot with like my most used jewelry i have two um drawers so i have this glass one which i love because you can literally see straight for it i just keep some jumpers and some shirts in there um down here i just have this basket it has two of my onesies at the back i have some bed sheets so yeah that's everything in my wardrobe i just absolutely love my wardrobe it's got soft clothes in like hinges um i think that's what they're called so it doesn't slam it shuts really quietly and my wardrobe was my most expensive piece of furniture i think it was like 300 and something but it was definitely worth it i don't think i've missed anything out oh yes i have i forgot something so how can i forget this this is my um light shade chandelier type thing it's actually from argos and it was only like 12 pounds they have a blue and a pink one but i just went for the clear one um it's super super pretty yeah i love it so much um so yeah that was everything in my bedroom and i hope it was worth the wait um i love my room so much even though my room is tiny i feel like i've been able to make it work my room right now is pretty much my dream bedroom i love everything in it i've always wanted white furniture and i've just i don't know it just turned out way better than i thought it was gonna turn out and i'm just so in love with it and every day i wake up and i just think oh, my room is so pretty now um it's a lot better than how it was before and it seems a little bit more grown up um because obviously i decorated my room like a good couple of years ago i feel like it was about time i redecorated my room so it's more for my age let me know what you guys think of my room in the comments let me know what color your bedroom is or if you you've done any like redecorating your room vlogs or if you have a room tour up on your channel then let me know in the comments but don't forget to follow me on my social medias and i'll catch up with you guys in my next video so bye for now